Good morning, Stephanie Real from the New Jersey Business and Industry Association. For the record, uh, the New Jersey Business and Industry Association represents over 20,000 member companies. And we appreciate the efforts of the sponsors to continue to have a dialogue with the business community on this issue. Unfortunately, we are still opposed. And I'll just be brief since we've gone on record before. Last time we spoke to this committee, we focused on two main concerns, the cost of this proposal for businesses and also the lack of flexibility that we see that this will impose on employers. And even with the amendments, those concerns still persist. And we'd also just like to point out in closing that the bill still imposes liability issues on all employers. It overlaps with existing leave laws. It prohibits all employers from requiring workers to find their replacements, even when the leave is foreseeable. It requires employers to assume any kind of documentation costs if an employer suspects that there's any sort of illegitimate leave and it imposes additional notification requirements on all employers. And that's why the Business and Industry Association at this time still remains opposed. Thank you.